six, five, four, three. Top. Well, not quite. Ready for your cup of tea? Uh, not really, Mrs. Heenan, no. I, uh... <coughs> oh, no, I'm late already. Oh, that's hot time. You've always got time for a cup of tea. Besides, it's Thursday work. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. Old twisted me arm, if I hurry. Pint? <laughs> the cup will do. Hey, Adam. Thank you. Oh, that's better. You know, it's good middle this morning. Here, yeah, the boys are acting up a bit, aren't they? Acting up? the prima donnas. Half the time, they refuse to come on. Yeah, and they make some funny noises at times, too. Oh, that's not my problem. I don't see why I should bother myself. It's Burroughs is the boss now. Oh, so it's fixed, is it? Yes, well, I'm not working for him. Well, I don't see why not. Everyone else is. Look, Mrs... Now, Can calm you know? down, Bert. You're not working for Burroughs, you're working for me. But he's going to be the boss, though, isn't Not he? Not as far as you're concerned. That's the way I see it, anyway. Well, if you want to take it that far, the brewery is the boss. Now, shut up and have another cup of tea. No, I'm, I'm all right. Look, look, you've got to see it from my angle. It, well, it's a question of principle. It's a question of money. Take the money and think about your principle while you're spending it. You need it, don't you? Well, I need it, all right. Well, then, just carry on and don't be so daft. Christmas is a-coming. The geese are getting fat and the ten bob a pound. Yes, I know. Anyway, if it'll make you any happier, Burroughs lost his first battle on the council last night. Oh, I feel happier. What happened? Well, it was all to do with Jeff Langley's one-stop shopping scheme. Burroughs was dead against it. He got slapped down. Oh, how hard? Well, he lost his vote. They're setting up a committee to look into it. <laughs> well, that's something. You know, I'm no politician, but I think old Jeff made sense. I mean, it should work out, shouldn't it? Mm, maybe. Well, don't you think so? Oh, it's the committee I don't like the sound of. You know why the camel's got two humps, don't you? <laughs> why? Well, it was supposed to be a horse, but a committee designed it. <laughs> yeah, they certainly take their time instead of that about that. Take their time and achieve nothing. I loathe committees. All the same, you know, in a way, I mean, it's a victory for Jeff. Is it? Well, he beat him, didn't he? Uh, well, Burroughs isn't worried. If you ask me, I think he's got something up his sleeve. You sure? Well, he's got that look on his face. <laughs> he's always had that look on his face as soon as he's born. Well, nevertheless, I think he's up to something, and if you ask me... Do you mind? We're not open yet. It's not nine o'clock. Mrs. Heenan, this is the bull, isn't it? I mean, that's not a cow hanging outside. We've come to look at the boilers. And who sent for you? I never did. Mr. Burris called us. He's a oh. gaffer, isn't he? Mind it. I suppose I shall have to get used to that. Well, couldn't you have picked a better time? I mean, I'm up to my neck. You won't even notice us, love. We'll be like mice. We won't even come out of the cellar. Hey, how about a pint? Shut your head, will you? Don't mind him, love. It's his lack of education. Well, I don't mind you looking at it. The job's got to be done sooner or later. But if only somebody had told me, I'll go about dismantling things and I shall be in chaos all over the weekend. <laughs> the weekend? Ah, oh, cut it. <laughs> I think you're being a bit optimistic, love. We don't start till Monday, and maybe not even then. We just come for a shifting, you know. Where are they? Why don't you try the cellar? All right, my old son. While I come through this way. Hey, hey, hey. Oh. Nice, isn't it? It'll be a betting shop before I can turn round. 